Emma, I love you. You've brought such an overwhelming joy and happiness into my life. As we step into our new lives together, I can't wait to spend a lifetime growing with you and growing closer to you as we grow closer to Christ. I want our lives as a married couple to point to God and to put God first above all else. I can't imagine a better life partner to follow Jesus with. I'm not looking back, only forward. There's no one else I'd rather give myself to. Just you. I love you, Gemma. Joshua, you're my greatest support and encourager. You make me laugh and smile and bring my heart so much joy. You're my best friend, my confidant, and the one I want to share everything with. You're the most passionate person I know, and I love that we share the same dreams and goals. And I love how your face lights up when you talk about something that you're passionate about. Because of you, I don't always turn the radio off as soon as the sports news comes on. <laughs> Even though I have no interest in what they're saying, I listen anyway because I know you love it. Joshua, you're my favourite comedian. You're my rock. You're my companion and you're the most forgiving person ever and you're my partner for life. I've never loved you as much as I do in this moment and yet somehow I'll love you a billion times more in 50 years. I'm so happy to promise my lifelong love, dedication and commitment to you today. made a commitment to each other. You started your relationship as, as partners before God and before uh, all of us here today. And today, it's more than just the two of you putting a ring on each other's finger. Today, it's all about saying, that was just the start of serving you, the one that I love. That's the commitment that I have for you. Your values will be my values. Your priorities, my priorities. Wherever you go, I will go. And that's probably going to be some of the hardest things. To go where the other person goes uh, in the support of them. As you discuss things, no doubt there's going to be those decisions that say, do we do this or do we do that? And in prayer, you're going to go, that's what we're going to do. We're going to trust God to step out and go on that journey together. 